Good evening and welcome to Thursday's edition of World Watch. I'm Samuel Burke. It was this day six years ago American forces began airstrikes against Saddam Hussein's Iraq. The offensive, which received, received the name Operation Iraqi Freedom, began the night of March 19th. And according to the U.S. Department of Defense, in the six years since then, 4,260 soldiers have died in Iraq. Barack Obama has pledged to withdraw all troops from Iraqi soil by 2011. The verdict is in for Joseph Fritzl, the Austrian man who kept his daughter in a cellar for 24 years and fathered her seven children there. He pleaded guilty to all the charges, and today he was convicted for enslavement, rape, incest, and forced imprisonment. The jury gave the 73-year-old man the maximum sentence, life in prison. Fritzl accepted the verdict and waived his right to appeal. North Korea has detained two U.S. journalists who reportedly entered the country without permission. They were arrested Tuesday when they crossed the river Tumen on the border between China and North Korea. The reporters have been identified as Yuna Kim and Laura Ling with the online media outlet Current TV. Laura Ling is the sister of reporter Lisa Ling. That's it for this edition of World Watch. I'm Samuel Burke. Have a great evening.